Welcome. My name is Brian Reese, and today I wanted to talk to you about our new Find a Doctor tool. As you can see, it has been completely redesigned, and there are several new features, and today I wanted to walk you through those. So when you first arrive on the tool, um, you'll want to check the location. If it's not the location that you want to search, you can change the location and enter the area that you are searching. Right next to that is a list of networks that are available. And so you can search and select the network that you wanna see if there are providers in. There are many ways you can search using this tool. You can search by provider name, you can search by specialty, or you can search by healthcare organization. We also offer different ways um, using the guided search where you can um, click on that and find different specialties um, that you might be searching for. You will notice this box popped up. This is encouraging members to sign in. The advantage of signing in is that we will know who the member is and we will automatically be able to default the tool to the network that the member is currently enrolled in. If the member um, is not interested in um, signing in, they can just click the X and it will go away. What you'll notice um, it, on the layout is radically different from the older tool. Font sizes are bigger. Um, and some of the key pieces of information um, are laid out a little bit different. The reorganization will help members more easily identify the key pieces of information that they're looking for. Once on the results page, you'll notice at the top of the screen, um, there is a number of filters. If you want to get more specific results, you can select these filters. You can still um, filter by specialties people or places, gender, and there is another button that contains additional filter information. For the purposes of this presentation, I want to only display people. Who are female. And are accepting new patients. And you can see as I scroll down the screen, the providers that are listed um, have all met the filtering criteria. And once I get to the bottom of the page, I have the option of downloading that PDF or sharing it with others. If I wanna find out more information on a provider, I can click on their name. And be brought to the details page, which has all different kinds of information, including provider highlights, which includes patient reviews, if there are any for that provider. the facilities that that provider is affiliated with, any specialties or area of expertise that that provider has, locations and hours of that particular facility that that provider works at, additional information like languages spoken um, or ages of patients that they see, and if that provider has achieved any particular recognitions. And then the networks that that provider accepts. Going back to the results page. The member can also search a map view. 
This is helpful um, if the member wants to clearly see the location that the provider is practicing at.